In this episode of How Do You Do That, we're going to look at how do you check to see if you can use your phone on Ring Plus. Maybe you've got an old Sprint phone in a drawer, maybe you got a new iPhone for Christmas, or maybe you want to see if you can bring your phone in from AT&T or T-Mobile or Verizon. So no problem, you don't need a Ring Plus account. You just need to go to ringplus.net, and then in the top here, you're going to click on BYOD, and that means bring your own device. So it brings you down here, tells you a little bit about it, but what you really need to do is click on this button right down here. And this takes you to our check tool. Now the check tool, you simply enter in the ESN or MEID for your phone, and then click I'm not a robot, and then click check my device, and it will either tell you your phone can be used or cannot be used. That's how you do it. Now, what is the ESN or MEID? And where are they? Well, on an iPhone, like the text right here will tell you, you just click on settings, and then you click on general, and then you click on about, and the iPhone will actually tell you this kind of information. Uh, if you click on, if you're in an Android, it's pretty similar. You click on settings, and then more, and then about, and you'll find it. Now, maybe a little bit different uh, depending on the operating system, but generally it's kind of the same. If it's an older phone, you can also do, if you hover over these words, you'll see how you can pull a battery out and find your MEID or ESN and enter that number. So let's just see what it looks like when it, when it fails, maybe. We'll just do a random bunch of numbers and see what happens. And so this would look like, even if you entered in the correct ESN, but your phone was not eligible to be used on Ring Plus, it would say, unfortunately, this device is not compatible with our network and cannot be registered at this time. There are other messages that might come back. For example, this device is not financially eligible, which might mean you owe money on the phone or you owe money on a contract and you have to take care of that before you can come over to us. Um, or it'll tell you, great, you're all set to go, no problems. Um, and off you go, you pick a plan. and Let's see if we can take a look at what that looks like. So I'm going to check this ESN real quick. And here's a congratulations notice. This is what it looks like when your phone passes. Congratulations, your device is able to be used on Ring Plus. And so you can sign up. You can go shopping down here uh, and shop for whatever plan it is that is currently available that you wanted to use. So paid plans, the free plans, whatever. Uh, for sometimes when running promos, what you'll see is that you have to log in above and it requires login. Like this is a free plan promotion. You have to log in over social media. Um, you can see our video on how to connect your social media uh, for that information. It's actually pretty easy. You could just sign up and figure it out. Not hard. Um, and that's how you check if your phone will work on Ring Plus.